You want to know how to pick the right sounds and samples to make a banging beat? There's a science to it, but I'll be the first to tell you. Forget science when it comes to making a beat. You got to make beats from the soul. Not that science isn't important, but if you start overthinking the process, you'll make something whack every time. I promise you. I'll show you three quick tips on choosing the right sounds and samples when making the beat. You can use these gems every time. They work. They have been working for me over 10, 15 years. All right? PL Beard. You know what time it is. Let's grow, baby. How to use the right sounds and samples when making dope beats. Number one, match the mood and energy. To be more specific, match your mood and energy. Take a moment and listen to how you feel and what's inspiring. Check out the samples that's in your sample vault. I talk about this on the other episode. A sample vault is just a folder where you have all your favorite samples in, right? If you're scrolling through samples and you listen to something that inspires you, you put you put that into the folder and you can make, you know, go back to it and make use that for future beats. All right. But you want to check out your sample folder, go through it and start to find the vibe you want your beat to convey. Whether you're you're in a dark mood or inspirational mood, storytelling mood, upbeat or laid back, relaxed mood, whatever. Choose the sound and samples that align with your energy because if your energy doesn't match the sound or sample, it's not going to end well. The beat is not going to come out the way you want it to because music is spiritual. It's emotional. For example, if you're going for a chill vibe, you might opt for a warm, mellow scent and soft percussion type feel. If you want something a little bit more aggressive, let's say you go for a harder hitting drums or a gritty bass line, okay? It kind of feels, it fits the way you're feeling. I'll let you listen to this beat and you can tell me what kind of mood I was in when I created. Type a comment in the comment section. What type of mood did you think I was in when I made this beat? Check it out. As I always say, it all starts with the melody and the rest is history. I find a melody that matches the way I feel at that particular moment or that particular time, and then that's the melody I rock with. I ride that wave all the way through until the beat is finished. Okay, the beat you just listened to, whatever type of energy you got from it, I felt that way before I even listened to the sample, so it naturally made sense to go that direction. That's why you can feel the beat and the energy of the beat. Don't focus on the science of making beats focus on the feelings that you have at that particular time that you're making the beat and everything is going to flow because your soul is connecting with the music that's the way you make banging beats (laughs) 